Hey guys, welcome to week nine of this cycle. Today we have Elise performing the workout demo. Many of you have probably had me come up to you and ask you to do a WAD demo and you're busy on Sunday or you're just not sure you wanna be on camera, but you should be impressed with all of our members who get up the nerve and come in to do them and even if they're a little bit nervous beforehand. Her workout is five rounds and she's gonna row a 500, she's gonna row 500 meters, and then when she gets off, she's gonna perform three back squats. Now these back squats should be heavy. The RX Plus weight is 315, 225, and she's gonna be performing 225. The RX weight is 275 and 205. So I want you to think about what weight you can do for this movement that, but, but the first round might be easy, second round's getting a little bit harder, but by the third and fourth round, you're unsure if you can make those squats. Of course, want you to make them, but I want you to think about that when you're choosing the weight. We might not all fit into these RX, RX Plus, L2, L1 categories, so I want you to really think about what weight you should be using. And it should probably be around 80 to 85% of your one rep max. For those of you that have pretty good endurance, it should probably be 90%. So let's see how she does.
225 because I'm more of a heavy lifter. Um, so I thought I could challenge myself a little more uh, since I struggle with cardio, but I love short cardio and short heavy reps. So I decided to go a little heavier. My method for the rowing was just kind of going slow and steady, not going too fast out the gate because I don't want to tire myself so much that once I got to the bar, I was completely out. I tried to distribute um, everything and not focus on just rowing with my legs, using my arms a little more, since for the back squat, I was going to use my legs a little more. The tip I have for this workout is just kind of pick something challenging, but not too challenging where you're just going to fail or change the weight anytime during it. Um, and just kind of keep going slow and steady. Try to keep it under at least two minutes to give yourself a little, at least a minute for the back squats and a minute to rest. That's the best thing.